What's going on people, it's Luma Day, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you four different Carhartt trousers and I'm going to show you how I'd style it as well with different fits. So yeah, let's go into the first one. So first we have is the navy aviation cargo pants which I got in a waist 36, length 34. And um, this is the slim fit version so I'm normally a waist 34 kind of, um, I used to be a phase 6 but now I've gone back down to a phase 4 so that's like my normal size now for waist but um, as a slim fit I went to a waist phase 6 and it fits nice so um, if you're looking to get a slim version um, and you want it to not be tight on you, you want it to just look normal I would go a size up, you could possibly go through the size but as a slim fit like I said just wanted to have a little bit more space around like the thighs and like my hips yeah I went a size up but length wise I would have normally been a 32 I would have went for a 32 but um, they didn't have that one in stock so I got a 34 but it's still not bad it basically sits over the shoes kind of nice anyways how I still like it but um, it's not that much difference but yeah with this one as it's in this nice navy blue colour I could probably just style these with like another navy blue hoodie with a white t-shirt underneath like how I'm wearing this and then you can also style this with like a navy or like a royal blue puffer jacket or just a normal jacket I think that looks nice I have one royal blue like puffer jacket I got from ASOS um, you can wear that together without even wearing like a hoodie or whatever just wear both of them together and then you can finish that fit off with white crepes like white air forces Jordan 4 Oreos or the cements they'll go nice Um, I'm not really sure if this would go nice with black shoes as it's navy. I don't really think like those two colours go well together, I'm not too sure. Okay, yeah, so the second one is also the Aviation Cargo Pants and I got this in a grey colourway. I got this in a waist 36, length 32, but the difference between this Cargo Pants and the first one is that this isn't a slim version. This is just a normal relaxed, well, it's not even relaxed, it's just a normal fit, but I got it in a waist 36, so it fits kind of big because uh, this was the last one they had on sale. Got this for around just under £60. I think retail for this is £100 or £90. I got this for like £60 or under £60 which is nice so yeah I got this in the waist phase 6 length 32 which is my normal length wise which I normally get and yeah this fits nice if it's alright but um, if it's something like this that's on sale and it's like just a bit big on me I will still get it because I can either just get it tailored or just wear a belt I tried this on with a belt and it still fits good so whenever you're looking to get anything on sale and you think oh it's a size big or even two sizes bigger I will still get it if the price is really good just, just get it and then obviously after that thing later if you're gonna get it tailored or just wear a belt just tying up because might as well but yeah with this one as it's grey you definitely see me wear different types of grey cargo pants right now I'm wearing grey cargo pants so and normally this is how I'd like to style it with this grey I would wear this with a white t-shirt like an oversized tee that's one way to style it and then I'll layer that with like a grey hoodie which I'm wearing now this is the not the night hoodie you see that Hard to you see the free um, but yeah, I wear like a grey hoodie. I like getting money, I got time to get it. Target on me, so my car's a tenny. Dancing with the devil, I don't bargain with it. Bobbing in a dash, and the stick is with it. And I hit the four or five on the wet side, but I'm from the east side. This how we slide. This how we. Obviously, I'll normally just match it with grey, so it could be grey sweatshirt, grey puffy jacket. I have a puffy jacket as well. You can layer that as well on top. That's really nice. Right, yeah, yeah, that's how we ride. Bone pro, no lead, no lead. Make it easy like one, two, three. And also, I got a hoodie, it's like a sage green colour. I think that goes nice with this grey and obviously I'll finish the fit with a white trainer those look really nice with this grey wear these with the Jordan 4 Oreos Air Force is obviously simple but it's really nice so yeah so the next pair of Carhartt trousers I have is called the Lowton Relax Straight Fit Pants and I got this in black I got this in a size large and again it definitely fits a bit big on me I would normally go a size large so that's why I got this size but yeah with this it fits big as obviously it's a relaxed fit I should have known from then to get like a size smaller but I felt maybe it wouldn't be big around the waist like that so if you're looking to get this relaxed fit I would say go a size down but yeah with this one this one's more like just like normal trousers compared to the rest so yeah with these as it's black as well you can really style this with a lot I'll probably just wear these let's say like an oversized black t-shirt 
and then I could even layer that with a oversized black hoodie as well, just wear all black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably wear these with like some Air Force Ones in black as well. I wake up, I go ball, I go hard with my dogs, bet it all, what's the call? Need a tan, never fall. There's no you're not that much to say about this, it's just black pair of trousers. But obviously the main thing is if it's the relaxed fit, go size down. That's the main thing. Okay, so we're going to the last pair of the Carhartt trousers, which is this black single knee relaxed fit, which I got in a waist 34, length 32, which is my normal size. But again, I should have known as it's a relaxed fit, it fits a bit bigger than I expected. So I went to the size, but this definitely fits a bit bigger. So I think I could have went a size down. I don't know if they do waist 33 but maybe 32 probably could have went to that size but like I said with the second pair of cargo pants um, just putting on the belt makes the difference you can, it will fit nice but with these it's definitely big throughout the leg straight down it's like a wide fit and even the length <laughs> oh, your trousers are funny fam <laughs> <laughs> the length 32 which is my normal length which I get and these definitely feel longer these feel like it's like I have a 34 or 36 length wise but um, I like how this has the single knee so this is basically like carpenter trousers and it's kind of like in a washed black so yeah with these I'll start this with like let's say like a shirt bar, fleece shirt bar, checkered shirt, like a flannel shirt like an oversized one and then I can finish the fit off with Jordan 4s as well you can even possibly wear boots some black boots I think that might look nice so yeah I'm gonna try that on for you and I, plan A this is planned out been smooth like grease been smooth John T neighborhood that's who Nicholas that's me been real to the T I never lied through my teeth why so yeah that's it, that's the end of this video guys. What do you guys think about the cargo pants? Let me know in the comments. If you guys are new, subscribe, click the like button as well, and I'll see you guys in the next one.